Well, there's nothing quite like this occasion. Welcome to the UEFA Champions League final. The best two teams in Europe this season preparing to go head-to-head -head for the crowd. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined as always on these big occasions by Stuart Robson. It's Galatasaray versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. And now the Champions League final commences. And the starting 11 for Galatasaray. Fernando Muslera is the goalkeeper. Lucas Torreira plays alongside Tongi Dombele in central midfield. And Dries Mertens starts alongside Mauro Icardi. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. David De Gea stands between the posts. Rafael Varane plays with Victor Lindelof in central defence. Casemiro plays alongside Christian Eriksen in the centre of midfield. And the lead striker today is Anthony Martial. Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. Well, whenever you're trying to defend against Wilfried Zaha, quite simply, you've got to be on your toes. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him today? Well, Derek, his outstanding attribute is his pace. Not just over the first few yards, but over long. Oh, it's distance. developing nicely for them here. He's done it! What a moment! The opening goal in this Champions League final. And just look at the celebrations. Well, here we can see it again. It's a lovely ball in behind, perfectly timed. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So back in action, and it's up to United now to be inventive. Committed challenge. Icardi. Icardi. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. Rifled against the post, but back in play. Well, United are still only one down, but I'm not sure how. That was so close, wasn't it? They need a reaction now. Well, before they think about that, they've got to concentrate on keeping the door firmly bolted. Can he convert? Off the crossbar and behind for a goal kick, Stuart. Well, he's so unlucky here. Really nice technique. He hasn't blasted it, just tried to place it. Probably deserved a goal there. And they do like to press whenever they can. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw-in. Torreira. Mertens. And teammates to play it to. and United will get the throw in Marcus Rashford Christian Eriksen now advantage Manchester United Rashford oh he saved it well now sending it in well, a bit short with the clearance. And so the half-time whistle has gone here at the Parc des Princes. <laughs> 45 minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. A very good tackle. Angelino.
Now with Mertens, prepared to take on the shot. Well, it wasn't all that far off the target. Well, you're absolutely right. That was close, but the game is still very much in the balance here. So a personnel change then. Bruno Fernandes. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Mauro Icardi here. Christian Eriksen now. Rashford. And the emphasis is on creativity. Yilmaz. Bodies forward and the break looks on. All hands on deck. Gives it a go. And the keeper more than equal to the task. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Well, they fancy a short one. Torreira. Well, no stopping him. It's there for him. Couldn't grab hold of it. Torreira. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Well, that save has kept them in this game. They now need to create one or two chances of their own. Well, not out of the woods just yet. This still could be dangerous. Now, options are plenty. But they dealt with the threat first. And given away. And take it away. Sasha Bowie. And players waiting in the centre. He takes aim. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Another goal from this corner would in all likelihood secure victory. Sanchez. And there it is. Full time. They are the Champions League winners. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. Here we go. The Champions League winners. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters?
Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.